So Vita Shell very recently got updated to version 2.0 so in this video I will just be checking it out and showing you guys how to update it. There isn't really much improvements um, on version 2.0 it just makes it work with firmware version 3.72 so if you're on 3.72 I would recommend updating but anyway we're just going to cross this off and we are going to go and update it. So make sure you've got your hen call running before you go and update Vita Shell or if you have permanent custom firmware that's fine you can just open it and update it like normal. So I'm just going to go ahead and start up Read Shell. Now it should um, automatically give you a message saying that there is a 2.0 update and if you press yet, um, X for yes it should just automatically start downloading. Now if you do not get this message what you want to do is actually um, connect your PS Vita to your computer and you will be able to get the Vita Shell VPK. That is the other way um, and how you can update so there's basically two ways um, either you know install it like this via the Wi-Fi or if you do not get this message make sure to connect it to your computer. So the screen will go black for a bit and in a second it should actually start up Vita Show again and as you guys can see at the top it's version 2.0. Now as I said if you do not get this message what you have to do is press select. You can either connect it via FTP or USB and you basically just want to connect it to your computer and once it's connected you will be able to install the Vita Show VPK. So it's very simple just like that. So there you go guys, that is pretty much it for this video. This is just Vita Shell 2 version 2. If you guys enjoyed, make sure to like and subscribe and I will see you guys in the next one.